Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 821, where we have 40 moves to have quite a few orders collected, 15 wrapped, 20 striped, and 10 color bombs. But we do have these mystery candies. Now we know mystery candies can be good or evil, so a lot of this is going to depend on what we get here. We also though have these lucky candies, and lucky candies always correspond directly to order fulfillment. Before I open these up, I'd like to try to take out some of the other things that might be harder to reach. And then of course we've got four color, color bombs as starters. I see an opportunity potentially to make a color bomb here if I can get a purple around this way. So I'm going to play around, try to take out some of this frosting that's in my way and see what I might be able to accomplish. Make some of these other... Oh, and we get more mystery candies. Well, that's interesting. So that changes things too. But let's just see. Now I don't like to open up the mystery candies that are kind of tucked away because if they're evil, they're harder to get rid of. When they're out in the open, I've got a, a little bit of a better shot at all of it. There goes that opportunity. Okay, so I need color bombs, and I need stripes, and I need wrapped. If I set this stripe, I need 17. I've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. I would get 9 out of that. That would be pretty good. And it would take out the chocolate. It would also open everything up. I'm going to go for it. One of my lucky candies turned into a wrapped. I want to hold off to see what else I can make on my own before I uh, take that, um, uh, the other ones out. Okay, so let's see if I can set this up with something. Now here's the, the dilemma though. If I set it up with something that I don't take out a color and so I lose the opportunity of maybe trying to make more color bombs but I still have so much stuff on the board. I think I'm going to just take out all purple, concentrate this down and see what happens. Yeah, I didn't create any new color bombs on the board. I do have this I need to get rid of. Do I have any opportunities for color bombs? Not, not really. Let's do this. And then this, we're getting those stripes we need. Actually, I'm not even gonna worry about any more stripes. We've got them all. Uh, if I take them out, though, I'll make sure that, ah, oh, shoot, that lucky candy turned into a stripe and I didn't need that to happen. Oh, well. Okay, so now I can make a wrapped candy here with these blue. And I still need a lot of wrapped candies. Color bomb took out a color, so now's a good time to check to see if I made any color bombs. Oh, uh, we took out another one, but we got one. We got a color bomb out of it. More color bombs. Buy color bombs. Color bombs, we get color bombs and other specials. It's a good thing there. Okay, let's see. I can't slide this red over to make this color bomb. And I don't have a lot of red on the board. It must have been one of the colors that was taken out recently. But look what I do have. An opportunity to set up these orange. And now, if I can take out all blue, I might be able to match this up with this. I only need one other color bomb on the board, and I still have mystery candies. So the potential exists there strongly to be able to take care of that. Let's see what's in this mystery candy. Well, that was not helpful. Oh, let's do this. Who knows what this will be? Okay, it's awful, but that's okay, because look, it set me up with this, and now I'll take everything out. I'm going to lose that color bomb opportunity to make more color bombs, but I've got 20 moves, a full board. There we go. I got it all. I was going to say and the possibility of more mystery candies coming down. So I weighed my the likelihood that I'd be able to work with this. And with only five colors on the board, once you have everything else removed, it's not so hard to make those specials. All right, that's how I beat it on my first playthrough. If you would like to see more videos, you can subscribe. If you have any questions or comments, please put those below. If you are stuck on something, I do try to answer as quickly as possible. And as always, thanks so much for watching.